I'm not muted. Hey, everybody, how's it going? Can people hear me? Can people hear me now? There we go. Awesome. So this is this is not the flagship tonight. We're doing something different. We're doing a uh, I thought I was going to be gone because um, I had a rap party uh, for one of my shows that was going to be uh, tonight. But then it got bumped two weeks. So then I was like, I'm here. I could do the show. And then I was like, well, maybe I'll just take a week off. But then I was like, no, the people need me. Yeah. And so then I called Sam. I called Sam and we decided to do a, a telethon. So we're going to raise money tonight for the Mars movie. And uh, we're going to pay attention to Donos because I got to be honest, for the last couple of weeks uh, when we're doing the flagship, I've just been so... Uh, so caught up in the in the in the scintillating conversation that I've not been reading donos, um, and so now we're going to pay attention to donos. We're going to read them, and also we'll answer questions. We're going to be a lot more uh, um, interactive tonight. So wait, you just didn't read the donos from last week? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and your phone's going through your computer apparently. Yeah, I have my phone going through my computer. That's good, right? right? So we can we can hear your uh, people call. So yeah, if yeah. you're some person, oh whoa, what? Oh my Somebody god, got, somebody went off. Someone went off, All and right. this is not the first time this week that they've gone off. Uh, they've gifted. Usually, it tells me uh, they gifted another fifty. They gifted fifty on this is WKUK Ethereum token. Uh, Ooh, so everyone, that's a, or do we have any Ethereum tokens? I mean, that's their name. Is that real? Do, do we oh. like have a, a specific like WKUK Ethereum token? I think I mean, maybe they made, I think someone made one. Yeah. We're, uh, uh, I, uh, so we're going to have a bunch of fun tonight. Uh, we're, um, one thing we're going to do is uh, also, I should say, Sam and I, oh, thank uh, you. tomorrow is the, is the, what? No, no, I, I, sorry, I was responding to something I was reading in chat. Oh. Oh. <laughs> tomorrow is the debut um, of season two of the Trevor Moore show on Comedy Ooh. Central at uh, Comedy Central YouTube, Sam and my talk show with uh, the lovely Blair Saki. And we have great guests um, yeah. uh, this season. They're going to drop two new episodes this weekend, one on Saturday, one on Sunday at noon. Um, and uh, I, I think uh, I got permission from them to show a couple clips. So Ooh. we can show some of that later on in the evening. That's um, exciting. But yeah, we have a whole new season starting. And I like this season better than the first season. I think this yeah. is, I think really good episodes this time. Um, I like the first season too, but this time was, uh, was really great. This was, um, so uh, it was crazy because we did it during during COVID. This was like, you know, we recorded this what six months ago, a year ago. Everything, everything got shut down because of COVID nineteen. Um, yeah, I, which is, now it's have you talked like about COVID nineteen yet not, on Newsboys? Well, I haven't talked about. I tweeted about it a little bit, but remember, like, so when COVID nineteen first happened. Let's just get into this. Let's jump straight into hot takes. Okay. Um, so there was a, a laboratory where they were, they were uh, cooking up COVID-19, right? <laughs> there was a laboratory. Like, was there? Yeah, in, in, in Wuhan, China. And then 12 miles away is where the first outbreaks happened. And so I, I, like lots of people, thought, oh, well, that doesn't look good. That's probably where the COVID came from, the COVID factory. You know, and then everybody was like, no, it's not from there. And now they're kind of like, well, actually, it might have been. They're relooking into it. So it might be from the COVID you, factory that you just accept this sense. fact. Well, if like if there is a COVID, fa if there's a COVID-19 factory and then 12 miles away from it, COVID-19 gets out. That would be my first place that I would look. But then everybody was like, oh, now, that's crazy. You, is, that's well, is the place is the place called, uh, like, like the COVID factory? Is it called, like, like do they have COVID-19? I have no idea what it's called. 
it's in Chinese. I have no idea what it's called. Like, but uh, also, I want to point out too, like, even if it is from the COVID nineteen factory in Wuhan, China, it's not the Chinese people's fault. Like, our, we're not we're not responsible for everything that happens in our country. You know, like, so I want to I want to nip that in the bud. I'm not blaming anybody for this. I'm just saying it makes sense that so, it would come from the COVID nineteen factory that's right there. What do you what do you mean by COVID nineteen factory? Like it's not called the COVID nineteen yeah. factory. Like, and if people are like, called. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. All right. So, but so what you're saying is there's a lab. Like, if you were writing an article, you wouldn't a, say there the COVID factory had an outbreak. Like, it's a fucking. Twix yeah, but I'm commercial. not writing an article. <laughs> no, no, I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering for my own peace of mind, uh, what, what the, what the facts on this factory are. I mean, it's a factory. We should get some facts on it. It, it was, a, it was a lab where they were making COVID. I don't no. know how you make COVID. They're <laughs> squeezing back or whatever no, no. the hell they're doing. They're making they're, COVID. They're positive that they were making COVID at this factory. That's their, it's what they do there. Why? Like, why are we making COVID? Excellent question, Sam Brown. Why are we <laughs> making COVID in factories? We shouldn't be. No, but why? Why is this information getting to you, Trevor Moore? Why are Why are you it's like news. opening up the 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 telephone book and being like, "Well, I'm just going to search for COVID in the tele." Oh, there's a there's a COVID factory in Wuhan. No, it's in the news. It's been in the news. I mean, they don't call People it the COVID it. factory, though. Yeah, Sam, you got to get over that. I don't remember what the name of it is. But but they're they're openly saying that they there they go. are. Someone said it in chat. Wuhan Institute of Virology. Virology. The Wuhan right. Institute of Virology. That's what it is. It's not the COVID factory. But and and what were they doing with COVID? Were they? creating covid in that lab or were they they researching different viruses um someone says why are we in food and drink oh we're in food and, drink. and somebody says trevor why would china release covid in its own country 12 miles from its virology research center i'm not saying they it got released on purpose i'm just saying you, you, you know, saw that you saw somebody, the stand and you're like a stand happened or you read the stand. I've never seen the stand or read it. Look, I've never seen the stand and I sure as shit ain't read it. <laughs> uh. <laughs> um, so anyway, what all that is to say this. What was I saying? Uh, Someone says, Sam, the, get the Fosse's dick out of your mouth. Trevor, get Joe Rogan's dick out of your mouth. Okay. Is that Joe Rogan's take on this? Probably. I, I don't know, but I just guessing on what the take is probably um i don't know i look i don't have a take i just think i just think that if there's a covid factory and a couple miles is where like i'm no you started I'm no encyclopedia this out brown i'm no nancy drew you started this out by boy, saying but I this is say, my hot take so you definitely have a take right well that's my take at the moment <laughs> uh but like, yeah, look, I'm no, I'm no Sherlock Fox here, you know, like, but I was that will highlights? say that when was that there highlights is, Sherlock Fox, I don't know. I will say that when there is a COVID factory and, and then a uh, virology uh, or virology, whatever, and then COVID oh, happens near Slylock Fox. Thank you, chat. Slylock Fox. Yeah. We should do that. We should I'm do a kidding. bunch of, look up a bunch of Slylock Fox comic strips and see if we can solve them. I bet we could. We're sharp. We're sharp. Uh, we're, yeah, yeah. We're, we're smart, smart fellas. Yeah, I'm just saying. Next time, next oh, Ron time, Jane, it just goes something. Off. Why I can't, can't turn my phone off? It keeps ringing. Yeah, the uh, the world keeps hates the universe hates your take right now because Ron Jaina just went off and gifted twenty subs. Thank you, Ron Jaina. Well, how is that? They don't. Ron Thank Jaina, you, Ron Jaina has hit the uh, five. Hundred or surpassed the five hundred mark of subs given. Wow. Five hundred and forty-three wow. subs. Wow, 
Talk about an MVP. That's pretty great. Uh, thank you, Ron Jaina. Uh, it, it's his take until it's no longer his take. Gasp, Trevor is a politician. That's right. That's right. Uh, someone says Disney is calling Trevor to telling him to shut up about China. That's funny. Um, what if that was? What if that's what that was? Um, the uh, I'm, All I'm saying is, next time a virus happens close to a factory for said virus, <laughs> maybe look into it. That's maybe, not- maybe look into it. Maybe just, just jump on the that's a conspiracy theory right out the gate. Because it mean, seems, well, it seems crazy conspiracy theories. That's not one of them. Like, like I'm, I'm just saying that that there is a jump in your logic. There is a jump from like, and I'm not saying that it did not come from a lab. I'm not saying that that it definitely didn't. But I'm saying that there's a, a institute for virology right there doesn't mean yeah. that they're a uh, a COVID-19 factory. They're but not. They, no, like, that's what they were making there. They were making, they were experimenting with coronaviruses. Yes. So that's all I'm saying. If there's a factory walking distance from where a big coronavirus outbreak happens, and some people are like, this seems suspicious. Maybe everyone else shouldn't be like, you're crazy. That's all. That's it. That's all I'm saying. Are you bitter? Because for and a I year, said, no, you've I'm been not. like people have been like, <laughs> Trevor, tone it down, and you're like, oh, who's crazy now? Ooh, they have though. They have. They have. I'll be. Uh, I'll be talking with people, and I'll be like, you know, it's that. It's that. Uh, that factor, and they're like, ooh, you can just see them clench up. They're like, oh, I don't know. That's you know, like you know, like that. But it's like, see. It was maybe who knows maybe, maybe who um, knows I mean still anyway all of that was to say how do we get on coronavirus you brought it up <laughs> I know but I, I, I it came from somewhere uh, um, oh oh well know. anyway oh 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 we're we were gonna, talking about we're your money show <laughs> we're talking about your show oh, yeah. and how we yeah, did it exactly. during Corona which was weird so coronavirus the coronavirus nineteen. Uh, like came out in March. That's when they released it. Um, well, they released it earlier than that, but it hit, it hit, it hit the states in March. Everything shut down, and we were about to go and film season two of the uh, the Trevor Moore show. We had to, we had to stop, and then around October or November, maybe it was maybe it was like October, or uh, uh, they were suddenly like, okay, I think you guys can come in and shoot, come in and shoot real quick. And so we went in, we shot the whole season, and then we wrapped, and then everything shut back down again and got way worse. That's when like the deaths really shot through the roof. So this whole season was actually shot in the middle of the coronavirus. Yeah. But so if you if you watch it, if season one, Sam and I are sitting right next to each other, Blair's on the sofa next to us. We're all just kind of like within like, you know, arm's reach of each other. And if you watch this season, we're all like across the room from each other and we're interviewing people um, through yeah. Zoom and stuff. But yeah. it actually ended up really good. I I, I like the the uh, limitations that we had. Um, yeah. And uh, so, yeah, there, there was masks uh, did you like this stuff. season? Better? It was fun. Yeah, mm-hmm. I mean, I forget a lot of it. It was so long ago. It was October. It's like, it's so weird. Uh, I, I remember there was a lot of fun stuff. I get buried alive this season. Um, and gets buried alive. This was the Flat uh, Earth season, right? Or no, was that last no, that season? No, was, that was last season. This is the season that we did a seance. We do a seance. I, I don't believe in ghosts, so we had... Um, we had a seance happen with uh, Patty Negri, Patty who's Negri very back like on the pompous. show. Yeah, she came back and she lifted the veil, and when you'll have to see what happens. Um, also, I think the two episodes that come out this weekend, we uh, tackled comedy. What is funny, and where is the line? You know, when is something? Can anything be funny, or is there yeah. some stuff that's not funny that you're not allowed to joke about? Yeah. Like, like a virus coming out of a factory. Um, and so we do a whole thing. The and thing is, is I don't is we... think you're joking. Like that's the thing. I think you're dead serious. <laughs> that's the trick, Sam. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, 
no so then we uh we we we, tra- we tackled what is offensive um and then uh and sam did a very offensive stand-up comedy routine at, at the end of that episode oh yeah 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 so we had we compiled a whole stand-up routine out of very offensive jokes and um uh and when we had sam do that which was great and then the second episode i believe is about cults we dive into cults like nxivm and that kind of stuff so uh everybody check it out should i show a clip yeah let's let's see a clip all right sam vamp for a second let me uh let me go find a clip let me I gotta. Ooh, I gotta resize things. Now, can I just share? Uh, give me one second, and then you can. Uh... And then we gotta read some donos, and we gotta like answer some questions from chat, because this is gonna be a, this is our very interactive show. Yeah. But so far, we've just been talking about Wuhan. This is that show where we read the donos. That one episode. Uh, Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm ready for you. All right, all right. Here we go. Um, Oh, wait. I'm going to hide. Ignore the logo. All right, I'm going to show a couple clips here, and then we'll show some later on. All right, this is good. This is, I, I believe, I believe they call this synergy. <laughs> but you can. All right. All right. Uh, I'm going to do the but screen. You- we're, we're raising money. Oh, by the way, if you're if you're just finding us and you haven't been watching for the last couple of months, we're raising money for the new whitest kids movie, um, which is tentatively called Mars. And uh, it's going uh, really well. Like we're over halfway there. Um, next week, we're looking at the completed animatics. Yeah, which um, is So the whole we're movie has fast. animatics done. Yeah. In a good way. Um, we've got a whole team of animators working. Yeah. Um, and uh, so, yeah, any donations we make are going straight to that and we th- can't thank you guys enough uh you are the reason this movie's getting made and uh and we're really proud of it i think you'll like it um all right here's a clip from tomorrow's show all right but you can, this could just get bleeped right sure i mean it's your show i think this is interesting we'll see where it gets offensive And then we'll figure out how we could make it something that would be okay for television. Uh, There's a bunch of writers here. We'll figure this out. uh, It says, uh, as I was... Mm -hmm. I thought I tasted horse... And I exclaimed, oh, grandma, that's how you died. Oh! Whoa! So that was... (laughs) I like a joke that tells a story. (laughs) (laughs) I'm just like... Shoes never I was in it. Yeah. That was a yeah. real ride. So at that's, what point that's a nice, that's a nice setup. So uh they're yelling at me in my ear. Uh at, at, at what point did now at what point would we have to bleep that joke? <laughs> Grandma All of it? Eating? <laughs> Hold on. Okay, let me, so I'm hearing we can go as I was You can't say that. Oh. Okay, so how we can make this okay for television would be what how could like, you can say we work? but not Guzzling, no. Oh, Guzzling. That work. Um, I was like going, going. Tons is <laughs> performing. Oh my God, Sam! You're yeah. sick. It's a medical term. Oh my God! So, as I was a baby. As, okay, there we go. Oh, there we go. Mark, All right. As I was a woman's. Yes. Are we good so far? Is that not bleeped? <laughs> no, not really good. What does that mean? <laughs> Keep trying. Okay, right. I'm, I'm hearing that anything that infers is out. Oh, okay. now did that get bleeped when I said that? Wow. Can you say oral sex? As I was performing oral sex, they say oral sex on the news. Yeah, yeah. Like, they like say a- oral sex on the. <laughs> See, this is how a writer's room works. <laughs> That's a good clip. So there, there, that's a little a little taste of tomorrow's show. Um, 
Uh, yeah, it's pretty good, right? That was a good clip. Yeah. Uh, Should I show another one? Sure. It's funny. I'm like, I for this is so long ago. It's like I'm watching all this with fresh eyes. Yeah, it's a good show. Yeah, it's, that's, a, that's a good show. <laughs> all right, These here we go. I'm going to show another You're one. You're wrong. The bleeps make it. Yep. All right, here's another one. This is about accents. <laughs> you can't, here we go. You can't get mad at a German right. accent. Not after the shit they right. pull. <laughs> um, You're telling me, uh, pal. <laughs> we're clear there, right? I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so. Uh, I don't know how to do a German accent. Uh, <laughs> can I ask you a question? <laughs> Wait, that's... <laughs> If you, that, if you don't mind. <laughs> is that Colonel Clink? I don't know. That's not German. I only know one German guy, and it was the main bad guy. <laughs> That's that clip. The main bad guy. Yeah. Hitler? Well, I don't want to say his name on the on the on the show and give him all that publicity. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That that would be that's the line. That's what we figured out is the line is giving hitler publicity <laughs> yeah uh you know so that thing so what we're talking about there is so i've talked about on this stream that um i love catfishing people you know it's like it's a hobby i think it's fun and um a bunch of my friends also like catfishing people and we kind of trade catfishing like you know printouts back and forth like look what this guy said look what this guy said and yeah. so oh my god this guy killed it, himself <laughs> and so oh, what a loser uh, uh someone said oh my google drive folder is public what does that mean what? that's not good yeah. i don't know um but uh so <laughs> so the they um what that was about is like we like to do uh um uh catfishing people and, um, and, and, and me and these uh, friends will like pass it back and forth and like, you know, look and, and, uh, and what you do is uh, we pretend to be uh, like a, a hot ladies. Yeah. And then, and then we wait for people to uh, uh, approach us, you know, like, and so then we'll go and, uh, and make fun of them. Cause there's, we have honor. We're not just going to go after yeah. people that like don't deserve it. We're waiting for people to kind of be creepy to us. And then we, uh, and then we go for it. Um, but so what we did, um, is, uh, I had one and I wanted to read it there, uh, on the thing, but I wanted to do the accent because when I read it, in my head, I do the accent from where the guy who was who was we were catfishing was from, and it was much funnier. <laughs> and so then, <laughs> and so then I asked about it, and they're like, you, "That's you can't do that." And so then we were like, "Well, what about a German accent? You could do that because you can make fun of, of Germans." Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's what. Because the guy was Asian, right? The guy was Chinese. Oh, are we breaking up there? No, the uh, the guy was Chinese, right? And you wanted to do that Chinese accent you do? No, I, well, should I say what the... I shouldn't say it. <laughs> oh, no, no, I'm kidding. You were, like, demanding that you do the thing with your eyes? I don't know. <laughs> I I mean, I get it. I get it. I get accents. But I also feel like, like, what if you say... Like, could you say, all right, I'm going to do a, a a Brooklyn accent. But then you're just doing one of the other accents. But as long as you're not saying it's from that country, does that make it okay? <laughs> you're like, it's a guy from that country in Brooklyn. He's in Brooklyn. No, no, no. No, no. You say, this is a this is a white guy from Brooklyn. But then you do the accent that, that, that makes the joke funny. That's still wrong, right? I don't know, man. How's it, how's it feel? <laughs> like in you. Does it feel right or no? <laughs> oh, that well, you can't. I can't. I can't base it off that. <laughs> um, somebody says that's actually progressive. <laughs> that's actually progressive. Someone says Sam Trevor. Yeah, 
Sev yes, Nasty no said that. Compass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, someone says, it's disgusting what people find offensive nowadays. I don't know. It's fine for people to find stuff offensive. That's what makes, you know, things very funny. I don't know. Um, the uh, Sam, how's your week been? Been pretty good. It's been pretty good been doing some after I've, i made myself i'm making myself little projects and i made myself a, a little project for this uh um for the upcoming buckerson and myers series that we're sorry to sorry to catch off guard there <laughs> oh 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 is this I'm, the intro the the intro that i was making and uh i'm, I'm getting there mm -hmm. getting there it's all it's almost done it's almost Barracuda says, Bar Barracuda says homemade fleshlights. Yeah, homemade fleshlights. Uh, if you guys want, I'll do a tutorial. Uh, it's you, you can just make anyone can make a fleshlight out of stuff you find around the house. That would be a great YouTube channel. <laughs> just you showing like. Showing how to make fuck toys out of <laughs> out of like stuff like from your home. <laughs> um, that would be a good YouTube channel. Like that's that's the most embarrassing channel for a kid to get caught like subscribed to. Imagine being like a, a dad and being like, I I don't care if you're looking at porn, but just don't look at this. I know it's on YouTube, yeah. but just because it's on YouTube doesn't mean it's okay. <laughs> I don't want to raise a, a, a weirdo. Um, <laughs> the uh, Sam, you ever bought a flashlight? Sherm Sherm ninety one said. Sam says anything can be a flashlight with enough effort. Why attribute that to me? Why not just take that? That's that's a funny saying. Sherm ninety one said anything can be a flashlight with with enough effort. But yeah, would you ask me? Now, now when I asked. I asked Sam, have you ever bought a flashlight and you changed the subject and started reading comments? And that made me laugh. And I didn't know if that was an intentional <laughs> thing or if you just no, did no. Yes, I have not no. bought a flashlight. I mean, would you like one? Your birthday's coming up. <laughs> it's not coming up. Uh, I mean, I th <laughs> that's one of those things that I think is like, like, I've seen someone get a flashlight for my, for, for not my birthday, for their birthday before. And mm -hmm. it's, a, it's like a funny thing of like, ha ha, gag gift. Pocket. Yeah. <laughs> like, they're like, I'm definitely putting this in the safe place. Oh, oh I guess I'll, I'll throw this away. So, uh, your wife doesn't find, no, 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 I'm good. <laughs> This has to be the golden age of buying fleshlights because everyone's got masks. Because that would be like the embarrassing thing. Like if you had to go into a fleshlight store and buy like, a, you know, because they're not going to sell a fleshlight at Best Buy. You're going to have to go to like one of those stores by the train tracks. And like, and uh, so now you've got a mask. So this is probably, I bet fleshlight sales are through the roof. Do you think... Like I mean, they they sell flashlights on Amazon, right? Do do you know if they if I don't if, know probably they sell everything. If you can return it, like they have such a good return policy on Amazon, like I wonder if you can buy a flashlight and but return if you it. it. But if you bought it on on the internet, wouldn't the government always have that in your file? And they'd be like, they'd be like, this guy likes to fuck flashlights. <laughs> And then so? if you're running for president or governor, yeah, you're running for governor like 60 years from now and you forgot that you even bought that flashlight back in the 2020s. And then like you're doing well in the polls and you're going to win. And they're like, wait a minute. And the government shows these records. They're like, this guy was fucking flashlights. No one would vote for you. All right. Well, I'm going to buy you a flashlight. I, I have your address and I have an Amazon account. And I'm gonna buy you. Yeah, a, but that's, a that's not gonna that's not gonna do anything to me because then if I run for governor, no, because they'll know that the money came from your account. So they'll be like, so if they said you had a flesh out, I'll be like, my friend bought it for me as a gag, like that, and then it'll <laughs> it'll it'll even out. God damn it! And then that, I'll still win the governor. 
<laughs> yeah. And you'll be fucking wearing the fleshlight. You'll be like giving your acceptance speech with the fleshlight on. Like fucking the fleshlight. Like, I didn't Everybody... buy it. <laughs> it's a gag gift. Get it? Funny joke, right? <laughs> Fleshlight, whoever Somebody came goes. up with that name must have been like, you got like a pussy Freeze and part. it's in a piece of plastic and you're like, oh, what should we call it? Hey, let's call it a fleshlight. It's just like high fives all around for like weeks. It's just yeah. such a perfect name. Is it- yeah. Are you froze? Are you- Maybe we should get that guy on the show. Yeah, yeah. You, uh, your your connection froze for a second. I thought like me talking about the guy who named the flashlight just made it really awkward for some reason. I didn't get it. Yeah, I'm like, Ugh. somebody says Trevor makes multiple Hitler skits, then says this flashlight business won't kill my political career. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It's true. I think think people uh, I think people people who who watch our our, people who have seen our show I think assume we own fleshlights that's kind of the vibe we're giving off oh yeah yeah now the the guys that wrote the rip your dick off sketch yeah those guys have fleshlights (laughs) yeah um yeah, I think I could still be governor, even with the Hitler stuff. What about the um, Miss March stuff? Just that the movie sucked? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think that would hurt your, your people? Like, I don't know, have you seen that movie? Well, you know what I would do is I would, in my campaigns, I would show like one of the three or four good scenes. And I'd be like, this is the movie they say suck. Don't go watch the whole thing. But I'd show the three or four good scenes, and people would be like, oh, what are they talking about? It's fine. They just want you to waste your good earned money and watch the whole thing and waste your time. But like, yeah. I'll, I'll cut to it and show you the scenes that mean means it worth, is worth watching. So, someone says you'd have to run as a Republican. Is, is it, do you think it's easier to have a troubled past and, and win as a Republican or a Democrat? That's a good question. Oh, good job, yeah. Trevor. <laughs> I mean, I bet uh, Republican. Um, I think they just. It's tricky. They both have real shit bags in their roster. I think well, Republicans are like more ready to like. I think be like, let's let's get Defend. rid of this stuff. Yeah, let's let's. Uh, Republicans are are the what? the the like high paid defense attorneys of of uh, politicians. You know. Yeah, and Republicans kind of like it, like once you're a Republican, they just rally around you. They like yeah. they protect their own. They don't eat their own like the like the Democrats do. Yeah. Like because like Al Franken, everybody was like, you got to resign. Like you know, with Al Franken, and like his was like a joke photo, like you know, kind of yeah. thing. And then like Republicans, there was a guy who was like banned from malls because he was like molesting people, and they were like, he's fine. It, he's still a yeah. good. Uh, he can still make good laws. <laughs> so, <laughs> so yeah, the Republicans rally around people. Ooh, Trevor. Um, but, but they all yeah. At some point of this this um, Marsathon, can we play marbles on stream? Uh, sure. Sick. Marble time, chat. Yeah. You heard it. We're gonna play some marbles on stream later. Woo! Marsbold. Someone said. Uh, Ron Gina says marsbles on stream. Marsbles um, on stream. Some- People the seem to like it. the marbles idea, uh, but won't there be too many people? I mean, this is like a, this is a thousand people. That's fun. It's cool when too there's many a thousand marbles like All right. going at you. You love marble games, man. You're gonna love this. Yeah, I You're do, gonna... and, I, and I like I, I like to see what it looks like. I'd like to see a thousand marbles in anything. Yeah, so. it's a thousand marbles, and we get to say someone's whoever someone's gonna win, and we get to say, "Hey, you won on the Mars a thon." Playing yeah. Marbsathon. Love it. It's gonna be great. It's great. It's gonna be great. Uh I should check out the the um Donos? The Donos. Because apparently donos. there are some we're reading donos today. 
we should figure out we should have a, a we should figure out how much money we've made in this in this show for the movie Ooh, yeah and then we could like do how like, they do on real uh, tell well we could do like a uh, a set like a, a sub goal or something like that now there already has been uh, 70 subs at least during this show because they're because uh ron gina gifted 20 i think and uh wkuk ethereum token gifted another 50 wow but, uh, we're sorry. doing great this yeah, is we're, awesome we're doing great uh, all right, let's uh, Just check out. Cur in my nuts as I still don't know how to don't think. Okie dokie pokey says Zach is rolling in his grave. Yeah. Fruit Bruce That's says true. diarrhea. Wait, how did how that guy know that hot? Zach died? We haven't told I, anyone. What? How'd that guy know Zach died? Hoshmosh says anyone. Trevor. Hashmash says, "Trevor, no rap party. No, it was it was going to be this week, and then it, uh, we bumped it for uh, two weeks. So um, uh, it'll be in, in two weeks. So we're oh, so you know. So the, the, we'll, we'll figure it out. There will always have something going on here Friday, probably. <clears throat> um, I have some donos to read, guys. And, okay, great. Oh, what a, what a supportive fan gr- group that has just been." throwing down their hard-earned cash and helping make this this movie and I, i've told you before I've, I've gone we've gone by the the midnight kids studio and jim who is an active member in whore town has said how grateful he is for the money that people are are donating and that uh you know that, that that you guys are making this movie it's very fun very exciting uh all right so yeah Bubble Bloop donated $20. And this movie, by the way. Whoa. So, I, think there's, I think there's a delay. Because I, I completely said that. Yeah. And you said, and this movie, by the way, and then stopped. So there's a crazy delay between yeah. you and me. Your internet in your basement sucks. I'm gonna say I know. That. I know. I have bad internet. Ba- uh, I have a bad basement internet. Well, uh, the... Um, uh, I have like little routers that are supposed to bring it down here, but I got I shouldn't move it up to the top floor like you told me to. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, is but it what really you're, that bad? you're gonna say? Uh, there's just a bad delay. Like I can tell there's it's, it's like maybe ten seconds between me and you. Wow. Five, maybe five seconds. Wow. Uh, well, you know what I could do. You know what I could do is I could go move my router right now. I'd disappear, <laughs> but I'd pop back in. I mean, nah, it's it's fine. It's fine. Okay. Uh, it's it's it just it goes in and out. Um, so uh, were you gonna say something? You were gonna say another thing about the Mars movie? Oh, I was just I was just gonna say that it's really good, and uh, like you know we've been watching it, and this is like an anti Miss March, where it's like you know like it's all working. Where you're like, oh, good. It's like we imagined it. Great. I, I, you know, I think it's fucking cool. We're just like trying to make something, and we're getting the the chance to like concentrate on these jokes and try and think about the best way to like present them. And uh, I think it's gonna be like a high joke volume, unique comedy. I don't think there's many movies that are made like this. Um, even like the shit that's like crowdfunded, I don't think. A lot of, you know, not a lot of stuff gets crowdfunded over a year, you know, it's right. usually like one drive. And, uh, so yeah, I, I feel like, um, we get the opportunity to be really involved with the community and make something. It's very cool. Uh, well, it got, it got meaner when we were recording it too. There's some jokes that we had said, let's not do those because that's too mean to like individuals. <laughs> And then, and then, uh, when we were recording it, we we're like, ah, just do it anyway. And then, like, I mean, uh, like, I know we like improv some that we we're like, well, that's not going to go in. And then when we saw the cut, the the guys just thrown it in the animators, and we we're like, oh, I like it though. So it's, yeah. uh, it'll be interesting. <laughs> yeah. Um. Yeah, it'll be interesting. It, it's it's yeah. I feel like I feel like the the 
There's a little peep joke that I'm not sure if it goes in the, the final cut. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, joke. yeah. That was just an improvisation, and it's like, and watching him like, man, do you do? Is it too soon to do it? Like, do you do that? So I don't know. I don't know. Um, we'll see. I think you know, like, like I think the thing that that that's cool, and not to like, I think these guys are like, you know, light years ahead of us, but I think the the production style feels a little similar to South Park, where we're doing things in a unique way, and uh, it's we get so much control over what we're doing so not to say we were we're south park they're those guys are amazing but uh i th yeah, production like production style i think it's like an interesting it's it's they're such their own thing and i think this is its own thing you know people want to leave in the little peep joke that's that seems to be unanimous okay. here yeah right. yeah and south park would do a little peep jokes you know so, bruh, literally got so disappointed when I heard Trevor get excited over a little peep joke. That's, that's <laughs> you just called him little peep right there. Oh, I did? It I'm sounded 40. like it. <laughs> <laughs> you know that <laughs> rapper, little peep? <laughs> little peep. <laughs> uh, all right, all right. Uh, uh, I've, got, I've got the page up. Bubble Bloop. Well, I want to talk to that guy. Hold on, I want to talk to that guy for a second. Don't worry. The the, the movie's not wall-to-wall -wall Lil Peep jokes. <laughs> There's, it's only one passing reference to Lil Peep. Yeah. And uh, and I was just excited because, you know, it just seemed like, oh, I've never heard anyone make fun of that on a thing before, on a, on a show or a movie. That's all. And so don't Sergeant, worry. You'll still like it. Don't worry. Sergeant Floyd, 1972, said, who's little Lil Peep? I don't know. Beats me. Uh, all right. Bubble someone said, I got all right. All right. Someone said, Trevor, shave everything but the mustache. That was Ness the Caleb. I am. That's uh, it's a, it's interesting you say that because I'm gonna do that this week because I've gotten really into uh, Smokey and the Bandit. <laughs> so I was like, the more I watch it, I'm like, I'm that's that's how I want to look. I want to. You're look gonna like do Smokey. a mustache. Yeah, just a mustache, just a big mustache, like like I'm not from this time. <laughs> Are you? When he said shave everything but the mustache, I thought he was talking about head too. Oh, I would like that, but I but I actually get real mustache. jacked before bald. I do that. Yeah, yeah, just a mustache <laughs> and then jack, but then like bald. And then and then I'd, I'd I'd look real weird at, at all the PTA meetings. <laughs> constantly carrying a big barbell like a big like one of those ones that has like just big <laughs> it's like, like a, a big tattoo of like a 1940s german eagle <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah yeah there are guys that look like that you're right uh yeah <laughs> bubble bloop donated 20 dollars. said here's some money you pours that's the only one i've read and i've read it twice uh Meadow Hands donated ten dollars. Said, "Let's go to Mars." JJ Marvin Summer donated ten dollars. Said, "Why did WKUK steal the Human Giant movie script?" Um, because oh, we were that? threatened by them. Uh, Blow your dad fifty six. <laughs> yeah, I mean, wasn't that a while ago that they were talking about that? Well, no, Paul. Paul Shear just used that clip as an Instagram thing yesterday. Oh, so he okay. Instagram that uh, there, this, yeah. It's there's him, a story about him and Manzuka. How right? uh, the human giant? Yeah, him and Manzuka. The the human We're giant movie about, got yeah. stolen twice. Yeah, yeah, and then um, and then and then they were like they jokingly blamed us, um, which is funny. But like, I I, I wish we were that proactive. Yeah, like, yeah. can you oh. imagine us like planning a heist of any sort? <laughs> I mean, rad. what's funny is that is that we had like a, 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 I mean, it wasn't as like, we've had moments that are very similar to that. Uh, we had a day of a day of shooting in the Civil War and drugs was stolen. The campfire scene got stolen. Yeah, we had to shoot that. We had to shoot it again the next day, and everybody was all demoralized because we just did this scene and like. I think it was funnier the day that it got stolen. Yeah. I who even knows at this point. I mean, yeah. 
Uh, it's just something that's happened. And then also, we during season three, we had a hard drive malfunction and... Apparently, the way that Mac hard drives, uh, like MacBook hard drives, like the hard drives uh, used to break was like really bad, where they had this defect where the reader arm would commonly snap and then gouge a, a, a groove into the actual disk. And we lost like, and we weren't sending ourselves the, the like Human Giant, we weren't sending ourselves the scripts via email. And, uh, mm. yeah, uh, we lost, like, we had to, a lot of season three, we had to write twice from memory. And we, like, we sent the hard drive to a company that, like, recovers hard drives from, like, Afghanistan. Like, when they find, like, a suspected terrorist hard drive that gets, like, blown up in a bombing and they need to recover, that we sent it to, like, that, the company that does that and they couldn't do anything because Apple sucks, I guess. Their yeah. hard drive sucked that bad. So here's the thing: if you're in a, a, like uh, an Islamic terrorist, or like in a, like a in like some sort of sleeper cell that is like trying to attack America, you know, just do all your stuff on Mac because even if they drone strike your house, like you know, usually they can put the stuff back together. You can't do anything with a Mac, so that's how you that's how you get around that. I'm not sweating. This is just some skin oil. <clears throat> what is it? Some skin like, oil? Is that no, 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 no. Is? I mean, uh, um, like a, a lotiony oil, kind of like a body oil. Mm. Put a little body oil on, ah. so I have a little shine. Uh, it's not grease. It's it's a nicely scented oil. It's, it's fake grease. It's not cum. Um. <laughs> um Oh, I got more. I got Sam, more what, is that the rest of the demo notes? No, People no. People want to talk about Drake Bell, and, and, and boy, howdy, do I as well. All right. Uh, uh, Blow Your Dad said, love you guys. Donated 20. Uh, Twerkin donated 10. Said, happy Friday, boys. The Marsathon's going to rule. Uh, Rob of the East donated $100. And said, Whoa, to Mars, $100. Rob of the East. Get out of here, you big lug uh look at you Ryawaska 91 donated ten dollars said what is your favorite tool song and why let's go to mars um oh that's Trevor? a good question mm, sober cool how's that one go i like sober why can we not be sober? Cool. You know Do you ever, have you ever seen those YouTube videos where it's yeah. like, like a, a a voice expert, like a, a singer, who's like, watch this like opera singer listen to Tool, and like there's like this like some lady who's like listen, and she's like, his, it's so primal. He's just, it's it's really weird. It's really weird. It's weird Nobody the stuff I watch. That was on a YouTube. basic song. So that was a basic song for me to pick. Wheel of Money said basic Trevor answer. But I mean that's that's a good song. I like that song. Guys, there when you are go. you gonna learn? Trevor's a basic bitch. And he's proud of it. I'm a basic bitch. <laughs> Guys. It's uh, fine. I also it's like fine. the first one. The first the first track on um the one that's like that's the I forget the name of it, but it's the Fibonacci sequence. They did one of them that's like it's all the rhyme structures in the Fibonacci sequence. I forget what it's called, but that one's rad. Ladder, ladder, Alice. That one's rad, rad too. Um, yeah, the guy from Tool, Maynard, yeah, used to have a, used to have a hamburger shop near my house. That guy does so. He owned much. a hamburger. He also, he doesn't he own a vineyard? He owns a vineyard, I think. Um. Well, Doll liquor, uh, spelt D A H L, and then liquor like blah, 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 said, Sam, thanks for your thoughts on Grapus last week. I appreciate your complex feelings on it, and I wish people were less shitty. You're all great in the sketch, but you bursting through the wall makes me laugh harder than anything. Let's go to Mars. Thank you. It's very sweet. 
uh, Allegra G donated five dollars. Hey, said this guy. What? Matthew White says Cybertech WKUK here. What's up, guys? Is that really Cybertech WKUK? That would be rad. What? What's cyber? What? Uh, I'm lost. Are you are you still there, Trevor? Cybertech Cybertech WKUK was the guy who uh, who uploaded all of our YouTube things and ran that channel that had tons of views on it for a long oh. time. Cybertech WK. I'm gonna I'm gonna open my door and see if that helps my internet. Okay. Hey, it's me, the real Cybertech. <laughs> ah, come on, Sadie Crash. Do you, do you think it's really the real Cybertech WKUK, or do you think it's it's uh, uh... I bet my life on it. All right. Uh, doors hold back internet. That's what WKUK Ethereum token said. I'm just trying. I'm trying. Um, uh, now, is, now is that chats... all the donos? No, no, no. I got a couple more. We got one from Alex Jones, oh. donated $10. Uh, what's a guy got to oh. do? to get an OTP HJ around here. OTP HJ uh, over the over pants, the pants ants job. Uh, yeah. Donate more than $10, buddy. Um, Joseph Smith donated $10. Did I read that one? He don't, donated $10 twice. Said, hey, Trevor, I know you like cults. What are your thoughts on Mormons? And then said, hey, Trevor, you like cults. What are your thoughts on Mormons? Apparently, um, they. I think it's a. Twice. I think they've got. A, they've got. They do a big. The cool thing about Mormons. Um, uh, I went on a date with a Mormon girl once, um, and and they all like they had like a signed. I think they had a signed times that they had to be at church, but. They do a big light show up in like upstate New York where like um, uh, what's his name? John Smith or whatever the guy's name was uh, who like jo Joseph Smith, Joseph Smith, the guy who like kind of invented Mormonism. Like they do like a big laser light show in upstate uh, New York uh, where they like, you know, like, uh, you know, basically they have like their burning man where they just basically reenact his life or something. It sounds insane. So. Um, so that's, that's pretty cool. All right. Well that, uh, speaking of dates, th three kids in a coat. You know why a lot of people go. Why a lot of people, what <laughs> this lag is fucking everything up. Yeah. You know why a lot of, uh, uh, Mormons go crazy. Why? You ever notice that? You ever notice that? Like a lot of times when you hear about a story or a crime from like the Utah area, it's like an insane person that's like really hot. Like the, <clears throat> because Mormonism, like they tell you that like God will speak directly into your brain and like you'll be able to hear him. And that's how like the church has like split throughout times. So it's like, well, God told me this. So it's like a big religion that tells you sometimes God speaks and you can hear him. So. If you're raised Mormon and you happen to have schizophrenia or something, you're just going to assume that this is God speaking to you. So that's why they have a lot of like, you always hear about these crazy crimes happening in like the, these Mormon things. And it's because, uh, you know, the, it's the crazy people think that God's actually talking to them. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Sure. But seem I mean, like good people. Great teeth because they don't drink caffeine. Don't drink it, caffeine. Great teeth. It's I, I dated someone who used to be or who tried to be Mormon, and uh, right. I, I forget if she really like finished it. If she really like, like fully became Mormon, but was like going through the process of joining the church, and hmm. it sounds very strange. Yeah. Uh, like there's like, you know, some places that you can't go if you're not like, uh, they have to like anoint you to get s certain, to get so far into the church, like physically in, into the church. Uh, it's weird. Uh, magic underpants. I, I like guess. that. Yeah, sure. Um, 
three but speaking about dating three kids in a coat said uh, donated one hundred dollars and said how much do i don't need to donate Whoa. to win a date with trevor this is a win a date with trevor on mars contest right uh oh! I think the answer is a hundred dollars. Uh, I think, Trevor, you got to go on a date with me first. <laughs> I think that's true. Uh, I'm gonna talk to my wife, and I'll tell you one thing: she does not like me dating. <laughs> She's not a fan. No, <laughs> no. Uh, um, uh, the uh, what? Um, two more. Of, uh, that's two a, more. Wait, that's a ton of. Uh, any okay. tips for balancing projects uh, and family when you got to burn midnight oil? That's from Grant. Grant donated 10 bucks. And PK Saucy donated 25 said, hopefully I can donate a bunch more money soon and you guys can help me animate something. If AMC pops, I'll have millions. Ooh. I made Ooh. some money on AMC. You did? Yeah, um... When, when they cratered after the meme thing, I bought some stock. Well, this that was fantastic. Thanks everybody was, for donating. Yeah. We're um, you know we're we're doing well. We should we're going to get an official tally soon. We should add that up and figure out how much we made in the hour though, so that we can like that that feels good to be like we're that much closer to Mars. Um, if you look at the uh, the picture that I put up uh, uh, on Instagram, I made a little graphic for Sam and my Marsathon. Um, the, uh, you'll see there's actually two new reveals of characters in there, and it's Zach and I. If you look at that uh, graphic, there's uh, uh, Zach's character and my character are in there, and we haven't revealed those yet. So that's two more reveals of characters. Ooh. Maybe we'll reveal more characters later on in the hour. Ooh. Yeah. Um, oh, so oh, yeah, Drake uh, Bell. Drake Bell. Yeah, yeah. What's going on with Drake Bell? So Drake Bell, you know, Zach's good friend. Um, yeah, yeah. They're best friends or... Yeah. Uh, he just got arrested in Ohio for endangering a... Or, or endangering a minor or something. Basically what it sounds like is in 2017, mm -hmm. um, he was doing a show in like Cleveland and a, a he music was show. chatting with a, a music show. Yeah. And he was uh, trying to, to talk to uh, somebody that he shouldn't have been and uh, they just arrested him for it. Um, so that's uh, that's what's going on there. That means if they do a reunion, the reunion is going to be Tig Notario and Josh. <laughs> Tig Notario? Yeah. Tig Notaro. Yeah. Tig Notaro and Josh. You, you said it like it's like a, a, a video game system. Tig Notario. Tig, Tig Notario 64. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh. Uh, did you see that movie? Yeah. Where, uh, yeah. Tig Notario had to, they had a digitally they they used the Tig Notario filter over the whole movie to like put her yeah. in place of Chris uh, Delia. Yeah. <laughs> now I'm trying to. Remember. Yeah. Chris Delia. That would be great. Uh, I like that. That's what we should do. We should put Tig in everything that like anyone who gets like uh uh like <laughs> arrested or like stuff we should have the and you just know when you see tig notario and something you're like oh somebody got somebody did something bad here's what i think do you ever see this do you ever i mean i are you a fan of clickbait oh hell yeah i am sam <laughs> here we go deep in these clickbait articles there are these clickbait articles that are like uh what what if what if x-men was made in the 80s here's what the cast would be uh, what if Avengers was was made in the 60s? Here's what actors, you know, and like, we should start making those movies. I'm tired of the clickbait articles. Let's like see, you know, like Michael J. Fox play Wolverine because we have the technology. Yeah. Let's just awesome. like mix I, it I up. 
It's hungover it monsters before. said I, it's pr pronounced Naruto. <laughs> Tig Naruto. Tig Naruto. Uh, I watched that movie and um and it, it's funny like I thought Tig did a great job but like it's so funny how they have to edit it because she's obviously not with anyone else. Yeah. Like and once you realize that she's not with anyone else it's hard to get that out of your head. So like no one really interacts with her. She's just saying stuff. And like, you can start to think that like her character's a ghost and like, doesn't know she's dead and she's there and she'll just keep saying things and people just keep moving on. And like, you can, you can kind of see through C3 or, uh, you know. So, so what'd you think about that? That was a Snyder cut, but it was the original movie. Yeah. I wasn't that into it, to be honest. Like, yeah. um, it, it, it it was uh it looked really weird the whole thing looked like it was shot in like iphone portrait mode <laughs> like was... everything was like people would be in focus and then everything behind them was super blurry like throughout the whole oh, movie yeah, it was yeah, really yeah. weird it was weird i mean like like i i don't know what they were like it seems like they kind of it seems like Zack Snyder saw, like, watched Aliens again. I'm sure he's seen Aliens before, but he watched Aliens and he was like, oh, this is a really cool moment where that guy, like, turns on that girl when the things are attacking. Let's do that in this movie. And, like, it just seemed like everything was just happening. And, like, it seemed, like, super easy for them to get to the safe. And the whole time they're like, yeah. there's this badass safe. It's such a badass safe. And then, like what the safe ends up being is like three booby traps and like a half hour. Like that's the only, like it's three booby traps and the guy's like, it'll take me a half hour to finish. Well, there's also this really weird part in the opening of that movie where it's like, so all of Las Vegas has been taken over by zombies. Yeah. All right. So it's like, it's just wall to wall zombies. And then you see all these the, so then the air, the military is flying over them and dropping soldiers into them on parachutes. And there's this scene where they're parachuting in and they're shooting and they're like, oh, no, oh, no. And then they're like getting eaten up and they're like, what was the plan? Yeah. Like you jumped out in a parachute over them. Like, you know, what did you think was going to happen? You didn't think this through until 10 feet before you hit the ground. Like, it's insane. Here's what we're going to do, men. We're going to jump into the zombies wait i'm gonna quit the army uh yeah so i don't know it was it was okay to it was a fun watch but it was, yeah you, you know, know like he, he he makes movies that like you're like oh that was stupid but i it kept me awake Uh, well, I disagree. I think I think uh, the the Batman movies are fantastic that he does, but to each oh, yeah. their own. Um. Uh. So. Yeah. What? So we're done with the the donos. How much do we? How much do we make? It was a lot. Do you want me to add it up? All right. We we That'd got be good. All right. Here we got five plus t someone. Do the math. Five plus ten plus sixty six. Fifteen. Uh, uh, sixty six point sixty plus ten plus a hundred plus ten plus twenty plus twenty. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> We're not gonna do this. Oh, I was I was pretty much there with you though until it got uh, too fast. Um. Do we, uh, let's, let's read some, uh, questions. Chat, does anyone have questions? We will read questions. Take off your clothes. That's not a question. Um, when's the next family more? I don't know. I'm going to do, um, one soon. My sister actually wanted to come back on. She had a, a lot of fun. So, um, you know, so I'll probably do another one with her. Try to get my parents on at some point. Uh, that was fun. Thank you, everybody, for being kind and nice. Uh, it was good. I can't wait for that to go up on YouTube. Um, and someone says, when was Trevor Sisson? It was last week, last Friday. It was a fun one. 
I got it. 560.760. Wow. But thank you very much. That's just in the donos. And uh, that's up until 8. Someone says, Trevor, you should do another Pete Holmes podcast. I'm actually doing a podcast on Tuesday. I'm doing uh, the Netflix is a joke podcast with Tom Papa and Fortune Feimster. Hmm. So I'm going to be doing that Tuesday. Yeah. Uh What's that? What's the what's the gimmick with that? What's what's the hook? I'm not sure. I think they just talk to different they just talk to different comedy people. Oh, it's it's like sponsored by Netflix or something, right? Yeah, it's the it's the official someone says it's the official Netflix podcast. Because okay, so it gonna, sounds I'm like do that. I was hoping you guys were gonna like shit on Netflix shows. Mm -mm. No. You'd be insane to do that in this town. It's, it's, it seems like like it's your like, breaks will no longer work. Netflix fucking sucks. The podcast. Oh, Netflix. It's Netflix's official comedy thing. Yeah. Somebody said Joe Rogan would be great on the flagship. Yeah, get him on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have. Um, well, I shouldn't say that yet. Never mind. I have, uh, I, I am, I'm starting a new podcast Ooh. Uh, pretty soon um, on, on, a, on, a, on, a, on a pretty big network. Um, and uh, and this, this is going to be annoying because I'm not going to go into any of it right now. But like, we're going to start it this summer. But uh, I'll, I'll tell you off the air, but uh, there's a guest I'm really trying to get that, I, uh, that I, I'm really excited about. So this was, I don't know why I'm talking about this on the air now, but yeah. What guest? Well, I can't say it. Well, give me a hint. Because I could blow it. Give me a hint. Uh, I'll tell you afterwards. I'll tell uh, you afterwards. I think it would be fun if you gave a hint that only I would understand. Um, <laughs> Jake the Tunnel Snake said, Trevor, please, please, please read my story. I'm on break at work. Uh, when I was in grade school learning about the solar system, the teacher wanted everyone to state a fact about the planet. I said, Uranus has a ring around it. And everyone died laughing. Teach didn't even correct me because she was laughing too. That's great. Do you think he was upset that I read the story? No, no. <laughs> He's like, I said Trevor read someone, it. Someone guessed the SEAL Team 6 guy. And um, it's not him. That's not the guest I'm trying to get. But funny story, I did try to get the SEAL, the Seal Team 6 guy on my Disney show because um, I thought it would be funny to have, like, the guy who shot Bin Laden, like, do a guest spot um, and, like, be on, like, a kid's show as the guy who shot Bin Laden. Um, and uh, But then he got uh, in, so I think he was interested, but then he got, like, a DUI, like, right after it. And, and they and so then you know Disney doesn't want a guy with a DUI on there, so that's. Do you think he he mentioned? Do you think he was like, really? I shot Bin Laden when he was getting the DUI. Do you think he dropped yeah. that? I would have loved to have him on and then be like, all right, just tell me, you didn't fucking shoot Bin Laden, did you? Like you know, like like level with me. He died in 2002 in Tora Bora. <laughs> uh, let's see. Does an HD copy of the best sketch ever, Maroon President, exist? Yes, it does. Yeah, we, we've we got to put some uh, more stuff up. Oh, we've got... So, yeah. who's... We've got five stories up on the um, Patreon right now. I think Timmy's is about to come up or just came up. I, uh, I've got to do um, my part, the part two of my story next week, and right, I think my story's get a, a like I can't wait to finish it. I'm like, this is hot. I need to get this finished. <laughs> Uh, I'm getting blue balls for my own story. My my story went on this week. How how was it? Um, it was good. 
Do you're you in it. Re- do you want to read a section of it? Uh, a selection? Yeah, I'll read a selection of it. Hold on. Is- Let me go get it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And then Buckerson and Myers is up on the Patreon as well. Yeah. Uh, where's Buckerson and Myers? I said this week. We we said this week uh, we are unorganized and uh, we we thought we would uh, space it out from the, the Patreon release a little bit more. So I'll. do you think Tuesday is good? We'll just throw it up on YouTube Tuesday. Yeah, but it's it's up on the Patreon right now, and uh, I think it's a, a a very good installment. This is going to be a good episode. It's going to be a good uh, season. Okay. Yeah, I know. So here's, I said I'm going to read a little bit of sometimes my. Sometimes I'm wrong. All right, I'm going to read a little bit of mine. All right. Okay. I'll, I'll read just very little of it. This is uh, my erotic story that is up on the Patreon this week. All right. Commissioner Darren led Timmy. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Commissioner Darren led Timmy to the crime scene photos. It appears somebody broke into the sexy town panty factory last night, murdered Miss Gladolin, and sniffed all of the panties. Timmy furrowed his brow. Any clues on who might have done something like this? Commissioner Darren produced a single piece of paper that was wrapped in plastic. He only left this clue. Timmy's lips moved as he read. He reads the note and it says, sniff a dee doo sniff a dee dee I sniff the panties for poop and for pee. No panties are safe in all of this town from the sniffs of the schnoz of the pervert Sam Brown. And then, <laughs> the pervert Sam Brown, Timmy exclaims, my arch nemesis. And so that's just one shaft. That's just one little paragraph. Of- Is it a poem? Is it like Dr. <laughs> Seuss? Or was that well, just how my character clue, talks? The clue that the pervert Sam Brown leaves okay. is 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 a poem. Yeah, I, I was about to say, did you write this whole thing as like a susical? Like, <laughs> I should have. Yeah, that'd be great. No, I'm trying. I'm writing it. I'm I'm hoping to get it picked up as a graphic novel. Uh, did you read mine? I did. Did you did. like it? Very, Are you excited? I did. Very good. Very, very excited. <laughs> You're like excited. Oh, yeah. I can't wait to see how Timmy rapes me. Or... <laughs> oh, it get, like I know how it ends. I'm excited about it. I hope one of the other whitest kids shows up and, and, and fights for my honor. <laughs> uh, I mean,. You've got the erection. You're, you're, you know, getting some joy out of this. Oh, in the story I do? In the story. That I don't I remember did. that. Yeah, no, that's how it ends. Oh. Is he, he, he feels, he, he tries to take your pants off, but the pants get caught on something. Oh, I like it. And then it's, uh. it's your huge erect dick. Your D20. Nice. At least it's huge. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Somebody says, uh, some says, so, da, 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 da. oh, why is Buckerson and Myers $25? What the fuck? That is insane, guys. Please well, lower it. I'm begging guys, you. It's going to be free on YouTube, the shorter version. It's just, it's it's yeah. going to come a, a week later. Yeah, don't worry. It's still You're still going to get to see it. We're still the people's comedy troupe. This is like, you know, we're just trying to get a movie made. So I, actually, I don't know how I don't know how the, the prices got set, but it all goes to the movie. Don't worry. We'll put we'll put a version. There's um, how much is getting cut out of the of the ver- of the version that goes to YouTube? Because this is exact, the, amount, but like there'll be, you know, it'll be a lot quicker. There's there's a lot of, you know, dice rolls and stuff and uh bullshitting in this one well, there'll be some bullshit yeah. like if the bullshit's funny enough we'll leave it in but well it's like, have like more usually the... wait sorry usually they're like an hour long but like this this one's two hours long so is like, like an, an hour, hour gonna 50? come out i'd say yeah. probably like uh i'd say probably like it'll 
a half hour will come out. I think it'll probably be around an hour and 20 minutes. Okay. Got it. Uh, I, you know, I try and get okay, like, fun. everyone's like, did I, no, no, I, I, I use this, this oil, this skin oil stuff. And it's just making me extra shiny right now. I'm not. I went to, Can you walk I, up I through your shower. skincare routine? What is your skincare I, routine? <laughs> it's funny because I literally on my show the other day I I, I I went through my skincare routine. Uh, At I, what age did you get a skincare routine? I don't know. Like I, it's it's little by little, and you realize that like uh, healthy skin products smell good. Mm. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you, like, I've, I've got this whole, like, like I've really upped, I've had, like, products here and there, and I've really upped my, my post-shower thing to be, like, a, a real routine now. I have, like, a, a beard cream that smells really good. Uh-huh. And I have a, a face moisturizer that has, like, an SPF, and sometimes I put a little, like, face oil on. It's, like, it's, like, vetiver and stuff, and... Smells really good. And do you do this on days when you're just going to sit around your house? Yeah, I mean, it's usually like a get out of the shower, you know, like do this stuff and it feels good kind of thing. Uh, the skin cream, I'll tell you this, is like the skin cream's got an SPF in it, the the skin moisturizer. And, right. And uh, you really should be like putting some sort of skin or some sun blocking element on even they say apparently if your room if you're in a room that's light enough that you can read you should be putting something on your face to protect your skin from the sun wow i don't do any of that yeah and you look horrible i know <laughs> well i look dry though i don't look uh, like i'm not wet i just got i got bright lights here uh yeah no i uh yeah i don't do i don't do anything i don't i don't um but i probably should you know at a, at a certain age you got to take care of your skin or you'll yeah. look all old not super wet guys okay oh here here we get some uh we get some uh, mean stuff uh turn to taylor says trevor you look like shit <laughs> um Wet team guy says, yeah, Trevor, why does your camera look like shit again? Um, eh, that's all the main ones. I'm not sopping, guys. Yep. I'm not. Uh, oh, yeah. Someone says, hence Trevor psoriasis from the start of streaming. That's right. Well, you so know I have psoriasis. psoriasis. Yeah. That's not from the start of streaming. Yeah. And that's a immune disorder, right? It is. It's your body eats itself from the inside yeah. out. Rad. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Um, all right. Should, hey, you want to see some clips from uh, the next uh, uh, the Sunday show? Yeah. Trevor Moore show episode two. Yeah, let's do it. Ooh, we got now another. This we got all right. Wait, I gotta stop you for a second because we got another hundred dollar donation from Simon. What said hyped for the new Trevor Whoa. Moore show season, boys? Let's go to Mars. Also, check out whitestkids.com. Oh, everyone! Oh, thank you for plugging whitestkids.com. It's the the whitest WKK plus guy, whitestkids.com, which is like the coolest website oh. we could ever. Like, we never we never did a good job at designing a website, and someone we were so lazy. Sometimes you're so lazy, good stuff happens. And we you were so what? lazy. We've never done a good job. We've never done a good job at anything <laughs> except making iconic sketch comedy. <laughs> uh, Carnage of Tarnage just gifted twenty tier one subs. That's fucking awesome. Uh, someone says, literally none of this has been about Mars. 
Should we talk about Mars? Well, no. I hope they're not talking about the movie. They're just like they're just a science <laughs> a science fan who's come in here and it's like uh, I saw they said a Marsathon. Like, uh. what if they're like someone from NASA? They're like, we gotta like find. We have this Mars issue. Oh, Yo, this we, uh, poll is hurtful, this guys. Quick, this... What does it say? Do you remember Trevor's gross arm that one time? Yeah, it was gross. Who the fuck is Trevor? <laughs> <laughs> so it's hurtful um, any way you cut it. Oh, I think it's fine. I like the hurtful things. I think it's, uh, uh, uh that's my thing. Yeah, but you also hate yourself. <laughs> and how? <laughs> um, the uh, someone says any sexy Mars stories um, yeah so this movie like uh, we're very happy with it I know I keep saying that I'm very excited like I almost like feel like we should start writing another one because the writing is done on this thing now like and yeah. and we got to prepare for this to be a massive runaway hit yeah uh, uh, and then they're going to be like what's the follow up I feel like we should start writing um the other one you know what movie i always like what sam brown and i wrote a movie oh yeah of ourselves that we were gonna do uh that we were gonna self-finance and uh and, and shoot uh it was a surfing film and yeah. uh i i read that a little bit ago and it was it's, it's very funny um it's called, called uh liquid dreams liquid dreams yeah um well, yeah, we should do a good. Uh, we should we should get all the wise kids uh, writing something again, just so we have something in case this thing is the number one blockbuster, and and dethrones Titanic. We should uh, uh, finish Liquid Dreams though. Yeah. Someone said, yeah. "No, no, I'm no! Surfing right is love. gay." Oh, do you think a movie called Liquid Dreams would be gay? It's called Liquid Dreams. Mm-hmm. Also, Sam, I would like to point out there's nothing wrong with being gay, so I don't know there's why. There's nothing wrong with being gay, yeah. No. You, 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 you went a little uh, old school there. Just no. kidding. That was a chat comment. Yeah. <laughs> um, the, uh, what, um, oh yeah, someone's going to show this clip. Uh, yeah. Are you ready? Hell yeah. Wait a minute. Let me, let me see what I'm showing. Yeah, don't show your your email oh, passwords thing. again. Oh, I don't care. <laughs> this is a good Sam one. Here we go. This is from our oh Sean O'Connor's in this one. And this is about cults. What do you want from the cult, Blair? Um, I think what I mainly want from the cult is um, a lot of money. People gave me an exorbitant amount of money and, you know, like had to cook me incredible meals. Okay. Yeah, the most Food and two important things to me. Okay, great. Yeah. Sam? What I want the cult to do or what, what, what I want to be in the cult? Either. What you want out of the cult, what you want your initiates to do, because we're going to create one here tonight. I want the cult to do all the thinking for me. I want to be right there. I want to be number two. I want to be in it. And I just don't want to do all this thinking. I just want to have them decide what I'm wearing well, every day. Maybe the worst cult leader ever. I like, want, you well, want to be yeah, in the cult. I think, no, I want to be the number yes. two, though. The like, uh, I'm like along for the ride. Cult. He wants to be a but follower. high up in the cult. Sam, you should have just joined the army. Like, you, you're, you want people to tell you what to wear and where to go. All right. All right. Uh, well, is the army a cult? Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Holy shit! What I want is just uh, blind loyalty, uh, an unwavering allegiance. Yeah, I yeah. like that. Italian people already yep. have that. There's a clip. <laughs> that was a clip. <laughs> the desk is so tiny. Yeah, that was like kind of the fun thing. Is like Trevor had a big desk. I had a kid's desk. Yeah, they. Um, someone says Sam is too pure to be in the army. Um, someone says Trevor only wants to be a sketch comedian or a cult leader. That's pretty fucking accurate. That's pretty good. Um, someone says, uh, yeah, so someone says, nice. Is this out already? No, these episodes start coming out tomorrow at noon. So check them out. We had a lot of fun doing it. This is the second season of the show. Uh, we wanted to get a lot of views so that we can do a season three. Um, and yeah. uh, some says get, get Blair on next week. That would be good. I would love to have yeah. Blair on. 
Yeah, Blair is hilarious. Um, uh, I was high in a hotel room uh, and I watched one of her specials and uh, my God, it was it was hilarious. You know, and but and then I told her that I was like I was high in a hotel room and I watched your special and it was hilarious. And then I th- then I got all in my own head about it. I was like, did that sound weird? Why did I have to say that I was high? Does that make it sound like I only thought it was high? I was only thought it was funny because I was high. But um, but yeah, Blair's hilarious. We should get her on the show. Yeah, I get nervous. This is now this is a sexist thing, but I get nervous about uh, uh bringing female comedians in sometimes because of. You know, and not you guys. The flagship is fine, but sometimes whore town can be a little, a little mean. You know, a little uh, a mean to to ladies. So that's that's a little little hesitation about. I mean, about bringing people into our our den of filth. You just gotta, you just gotta, you know, like stand by her. Don't like sell her out. <laughs> don't, oh no! Don't, I would never. Don't I leave would her never. to the wolves. You know. Be like, oh, yes. you got if yourself into it. You got yourself. I don't know. They're good to me. They're good to me. Uh, someone says you cultivated that brand. I did not. <laughs> eh, maybe I don't know. Um, <laughs> but I brought my sister. I brought my sister on the show, and it yeah. was lovely to her. But I wasn't that worried because I was like, yeah, my sister can take it. She's like, uh, you know, it's like she's a more. She'll be fine. Like you know. Um, but, but people were very nice to her. So, yeah. Uh, Someone says she couldn't see chat. I'm pretty sure. No, she was watching chat. Holy shit. Actual Drake Bell crime news. Check Twitter. Yeah, we know. We talked about it already. Is there more? Is there more? Did something else happen? Is he on the run? That would be crazy. If, so- if it was like live police footage. So he was talking to an, an underage lady, it sounds like. Allegedly. Allegedly. And at, at what point were they like, this has gone on too far? Did he kiss her? I don't know. But you can't give someone a, a ticket for kissing, so they had to give it a... <laughs> 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 you got a kissing ticket. <laughs> she uh, kissing underage. Uh, she's too... Uh. <laughs> Yeah, his mugshot is strange. Let's see his mugshot. I'll pull it up. All right, all right. You're under arrest. They drag him down. What did he do? <laughs> this guy's kissing kids. <laughs> You're under arrest for kissing kids. <laughs> yeah, you never get arrested. It's never kissing. It's got to be more than that. They're not going to arrest you for kissing. I mean, but they have to. If you're going around and kissing kids... <laughs> they can't go, oh, it's not technically illegal. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what the <laughs> Let's wait till he gets to second base. <laughs> Over the clothes like is okay. <laughs> can't do anything. I'm kissing him. Touching him over the clothes. Oh, man. You know what they do to kid kissers in prison? <laughs> uh, yeah, his uh, here's his. Ooh, actor Drake Bell arrested for crimes against a child. That sounds horrible. Crimes against a child. Why does that sound worse? That sounds worse, doesn't it? Because it sounds like like crimes against humanity, like. Sounds like yeah. It's like we're, we're we're charging you with crimes against a child. Couldn't you just say like molestation? They're like no. It's just like he did something that like weakened the concept of children. Like crimes against a child it sounds horrible. Um, all right. Oh, let's see. Let's see that. Let's see this. Uh, mug Here's shot. mugshot here. That's like that's not how they do mugshots usually, is it? <laughs> that's the mugshot. That's uh, that's not even how they do yeah, that's yearbook the photos. <laughs> what? <laughs> like, what? No way. In a suit, they let him. It is. They let him keep the. It's just says, look, it says Drake Bell poses for a mugshot in Cleveland, Ohio. Like usually they're in now. like a yeah police thing, but also it's like this is like this is 
like the wall at an indoor pool. Yeah. Like they basically, <laughs> like they don't have a backdrop for mug shots. What's going on in Cleveland? This is like, like they like someone created this from like an Instagram story or something. Like someone took a still and was like, here's the mug shot. See, is this clickbait? I don't know. Are we getting clickbaited? Maybe he's tired of his bitchcraft. Maybe, maybe a kid went to one of his concerts. A child went to one of his concerts and it was so bad. They were like, this is, this is a crime against this child. You're under arrest for a crime against this child. I've never heard of that term. Yeah, that's weird. crime against crime against child crime crimes against crimes against the child so multiple yeah this is crime? not just a kiss <laughs> this is second based at least man uh you know a friend of mine played his girlfriend on the tv show oh yeah i knew that heard that yeah Yep. Did he do any crimes against? Sport. Did he do any no, crimes against her? I don't think so. I never asked. But uh, uh, man, uh, well, that's well, that's. Should we? Drake Bell's not having a good uh, 2021. Should we? Uh, um, I thought he lived in Mexico. Now I thought he was Mexican. I thought he had moved. He changed his name, <laughs> like he had become a Mexican citizen, and he was just making uh, Spanish music. Uh, let, let me read the rest of the donos. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm not as up on the... Whoa! What? Guys, we've got a new king of the night. King of the the, the Trevor Morathon. Uh, Flowers18 donated $200. Said, hey guys, roast Whoa. my art. Also, I'm into archery now. I print fun little labels for my arrows. So the zombies get a cute message. Oh. To the brain, southern folklore, sexual promises. So anal, volley sluts. I think those are the, the cute messages. Or he's having a stroke. <laughs> <laughs> uh, roast roast wow, that's your awesome. art. Huh? Wow. That's, thank you so much. Did he include art for us to roast? Um... They did not. I don't think. Maybe oh. it's on. On. Oh wait, is it, isn't Flowers the the girl that did the uh, the um, Sam Brown drawing? I have no idea. Is I, I I always thought Flowers was a guy. Um, I, I, I have know. no idea. Uh, Someone says no. You're thinking of Pitbull. Oh, Pitbull, the the rapper. Flowers had the flowers had the dick story. Yeah, flowers is a guy. Oh, flowers is a guy. Flowers is the one with the dick story. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah flowers okay. is cool. Flowers is right. flowers. Did the... Thank you again so much. My God, this is this is incredible. Um, yeah, flowers is a beast. He's like funding this. Him and Ron Jiner are funding this movie. That's great. It's crazy. That's cool. Yeah. All right. Um. Oh, I was thinking Lydia Petunia. That's who I was thinking of. See Petunia uh, Flowers. Well, they're both flower there. Yeah. Uh, now the chat, is, the chat is talking about whether or not there are any girls in here whatsoever. They're saying it's eighty percent dudes and twenty percent liars. I don't think that's true. Um, should I DM Link? Yeah, sure. DM a link. Uh, we've done a poll. We've ladies. done a poll. So, succubus Sally, prefix suffix twenty six. It's Lizzie Love. May McDonald music. There's girls in here. Goat station. I'd say it's 50% girls and 50% guys. Yeah. I think that's... Yeah, 60-40. If, if society has anything to, to say about it, it's 50-50. Yeah, if there's anything that I've learned about the world is that everything is equally spread out. Yeah. Um... So yeah, I, I think uh, gotta, the poll you, is oh, up. Oh, there's so, a poll. Are, so are vote you a on dude the poll. or not? 
dude. I'm gonna vote not nah because I want I want it to be not as but that 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 compromises it then. No, I won't. Yeah, yeah. Don't compromise it, guys. And guys, this uh, never lie in our polls. Like that's a thing about us. You should never lie in our polls. What was I gonna do? Oh, um, donos, right? Oh yeah, and the the it's gonna check the DMs. Check the DM. Uh, while this is happening for the. The whisper. Uh, yo, flowers, I'm waiting for that, that whisper. Send that whisper this way. What should, um, <clears throat> is Sam, is there anything else that you want to say about Mars? Um, hmm. Uh, I think prepare yourself for kind of a slow period because like, well, it's like right now we're going to, to the animatic and we're getting the animatics done. Uh, I think it's going to slow down. Oh, we should bring Savan and on. We should bring Savon on to talk about the yeah. thing, but we're I think we're we're about to like hit a slow period where it's going to take a while to actually get it animated, you know. Well, that takes that takes a while, yeah. But there, I I I've heard that it'll be done by the winter. Yeah, yeah. So that's why I can tell you the thing. The thing I, I'm excited about two things with this. One is I'm excited to get it into festivals because yeah. I want to like travel with this and and uh, force people who aren't white as kids fans to watch it like I'm very excited about that like having it play at festivals where like people who have no idea who we are or anything or like or like what kind of humor it's going to be are just sitting there because oh this is the new animated film that's playing at this festival and I, uh, I'm very excited about that do you think like and if we then if we get into like some like fun festivals, some like some big festivals, we should probably plan shows around those festivals, right? Like before, like the night before yeah. the screening, go do a show somewhere, and then everyone knows that like, hey, we're doing the screening the next night, and then we stack yeah. the audiences Our and we get those little <laughs> flower things on their poster because we we get the well, audience prizes. The little part of me wants to. There's a lot of different ways to do this. Like, what, I mean, I think it figure it depends on where we end up. So, okay, the poll's done. It's about seventy-five uh, percent dudes, twenty-five percent girls. Yeah, three to four, three. Uh, you know, three four. So that's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, the uh, so uh, what I what I would love to do is hopefully wherever we get to distribute it. Hopefully yeah. what they would let us do is like in the weeks leading up to it distributing um, that we could do like a tour around the country, do a show and then have premieres in town in like in like towns and stuff. So that way we can kind of take it around and let all the people see it and stuff like that. That would be very fun. I think that would be a blast. But we might we might get so. to some some uh, festivals where they're like, oh, you got into this festival, but if you want to get into this festival, you you have to premiere it here. Like that's the hope, right? All right, maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, flowers is art. We got to roast flowers is art. Here Are you gonna go. show it? Yeah. Uh, hold on one second. Oh, it's good though. Yeah. These are good. That's cool. Very vaginal. Yeah. That cross thing there. That's fun. What's very vaginal? That's just some bullshit you learned in art school. Just to say that something looks vaginal. I mean that that doesn't look like a vagina cross in that guy's face there. It looks like a fucking predator. The predator looks like a vagina. Dude, Tre Trevor, I think uh, you're news newsflash. 
newsflash about the predator the predator is a statement about vaginas no it's not that's yeah. a funny what a feminist film class you took you gotta you gotta rewatch predator man that whole thing what all these the muscle fuck? men fighting this vagina this this unseen monster that oh that God. can get you around any turn i don't believe that read a book man philistine <laughs> uh is that a real theory that the predators are supposed to be vaginas i mean i bet someone has that theory (laughs) i i was just i was just riffing yeah these are great yeah look at this one yeah some of them are so good they don't even look like paintings they look like they're photos yeah Wow, this is some really cool desert photography. Wow, look at that. That's awesome. Yeah. Is that, fo- is that photoshopped at all? No. <laughs> I'm just answering uh, for him. Uh, I'm just curious. He's not here, so I'll just. Sometimes people will do that where they'll like take uh, an expo like mix exposures, where they'll like take an exposure that like gets the sky and everything like that and then like get a different exposure to get the landscape i heard that's not true <laughs> some sometimes um, people do it it's a cool little squirrel it's a cool squirrel squirrel Did someone you says you're squirrel? supposed to be roasting these yeah, yeah. Oh, that's, tos that's, that's, that's TOS. Crazy about that. That, that's not even a real squirrel like that's like he he handcrafted that. That's incredible. He he made that squirrel. He went. Yeah, he made it. He whittled it and then he painted it. Yeah, it looks so lifelike. It's really good. So we should say so everybody should go and follow this guy. Uh, follow O F Copper and Stone. <laughs> yeah. Goat Station just said that's a chipmunk. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's not a squirrel? It's a chipmunk, apparently. Yeah, because it doesn't have a big bush, What's bushy the tail. Between... The tail. Squirrels that's have the big difference? bushy tails, yeah. Uh, yeah. Hey, whoever <laughs> said that? I'm not a fucking zoologist. <laughs> I'm, not the, I'm not a zoo guy, okay? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. That's a squirrel to me. I love this picture. That squirrel looks like... There's there's a look of fear in that squirrel's like ah, you got me. Well, they're terrified all the time. Yeah. A lot of a lot of of biologists actually believe that squirrels are uh, uh, the reincarnated souls of people who have been bad, like rapers and murderers, um, and like so they constantly live in fear of like dogs shredding them. Or like hawks ripping them apart. And that's like what happens if you like there isn't a hell, but if you sin a lot, you'll become like a squirrel. Look at this. That's he's, what a lot of biologists think. Uh, a lot of <laughs> he's making a ukulele. It looks like he's using cement to mold the the wood for the the body of the ukulele. This like outside piece here. Uh wild. It's cool. a finished product. Well, great work. Great work. It We're supposed good. to be roasting it, but sorry. It's pretty good. Yeah. All that cool art looks real stupid. How about that? That was a good roast. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, your art's fucking dumb for being good. Um, Are you going to do the marble thing? Should we do the marble thing? Yeah, let's, let's, uh, uh, we'll do the marble thing. Yeah, let's do it. All right, so so this is cool. You you have more donos. Yeah, yeah. Can you read the donos? Do you, do you, do you remember how? No, we'll do one more round of reading donos after the marble thing. All right. Why well, don't here? Uh, Someone said, "Did the flagship not miss?" By the way, this isn't the flagship. This is uh, Sam and Trevor's uh, Marsathon. This is our Marsathon, our Toyota Thon. Yeah. You could tell it wasn't a it wasn't a flagship because we were reading donos. 
and we were answering <laughs> questions from the chat. And it's, but can, I gotta say, I love the Friday night time slot because we have the the, the flagship Friday flagship the the flagship nation here. And 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 my God, they're the best fans. They're the best chat of any stream. Aren't you seeing that, Sam? How yeah. incredible are these people? Yeah. I mean, the Wednesday night crowd, not a bad crowd. They're my people. <clears throat> Strong people. They're cool. I respect that. The Sunday night that. people, the Sunday night people are cool. That show's cool. You should come do that show. Some. I mean, I three nights in a row, it's really tough. But you should no, come. I just, I have, I, I'm just booked. You should come. Just Trailer Boys is like you can drink more. You can drink yourself into oblivion. There's, there's so I much going on. That's the thing is, I, I like to have a little bit of a drink when I, uh, when I Twitch stream because it's just, yeah. it's fun. But I, I don't want to add nights where I'm drinking. Yeah, that's the All thing. Right, yeah. Like I like only like, you know, I can do I'll do Friday or Saturday, have some drinks, but I don't want to be drinking like a bunch of nights a week, you know, so. Uh, uh, have you guys talked to Zach? I talk to Zach every now and then. I, I've been talking with him. He's doing well. What he are you misses talking everyone. About? You, do I'm you just, just call him to chat? Nothing. Do you call him to chat or is it specific stuff? I have. I have. Yeah. I haven't, I haven't called him and, to and, chat. And, yeah, no, we we talk. You don't uh, call me good. to chat. You I talk to you four hours a day. I talk, I talk to you on. I talk to you for two hours a day on uh, the, the the thing. All right. I mean, it's work, but okay. Uh, <laughs> no, I went to. I I. Well, are you you are you leaving your house now? Yeah. Okay. I went to the gym today. I did some rock climbing. Climbed a V two today. Uh, See, one of the last things I did in the old world was go rock climbing with you. Yeah. That was real. That was one of the last, that was like the last week before everything shut down. I'm getting back into it. Getting back into it. Nice. Uh, And it's scary again. Uh, Yeah. Well, now you're older. Well, like when I went before, I'd like been going like a couple times a week and, uh, it like, you know, you kind of get used to like, oh, I can grab this and probably pull myself up here and put my foot here and feel stable. And now I'm back to like, I haven't been in a year. And now it's like every second I feel like I'm going to fall down and break my neck. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You know, um, the, uh, oh, I forgot what I was going to say. Yeah. Because you go to, you go still going to that same gym. Yeah. That rock climbing gym? Yeah, Hollywood Boulder. Yeah. Well, now, right. why are you fucking why are you fucking telling everyone where you're going to a gym? You're going to get murdered. <laughs> well, they got to join the gym. I think it'll be good publicity for them. We'll get all these murderers jo- joining their gym. Oh, yeah. Uh, like, if I was, if somebody really wanted to kill you, they're like, well, I'm not going to pay twenty nine ninety nine to do it. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, I forget what the the last one we read was. Uh, I mean, I read the two hundred dollar one, but the, I just saw that and I went out of order. Oh shit! Did we get another hundred? Oh, that's crazy. Uh, Mike the Live says get Blair Saki on the show. I would love to. I'll, I'll try. Okay. I think this one, Jake9890 donated $10, said, Hey, Sam Trevor, loving the show. Can't wait to see the new movie. WKUK forever. Uh, all right, wait. Yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, Z Rogue WKUK forever. said, donated $30, said, My name's Dingo. Well, why don't you write that as your name? Benaconda donated twenty dollars. Said nobody calls me queer in front of my boy. Happy Pride Month, boys! Oh, well, I hope you know. If someone does call you queer, that's fine. That's cool. <clears throat> Getting high oh, with dinosaurs. Yep. What were you gonna say? Oh, oh, here's a good comment. Someone goes, "America is stolen land," and you guys never even talk about it on stream. Sam? <laughs> True. I mean, 
Watch Buckerson and Myers. Uh, First of all, I would say allegedly. It's allegedly stolen. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like America's committed. I wasn't there. I, I don't know. Committed genocide. It's crazy. Uh, getting high with dinosaurs donated $45 said, I promise this question doesn't mean I love you any less, but when does Zach come home? That's Trevor. Do you know? Well, I believe he started filming the movie now. So I forget how many weeks he's shooting, but I would, I would probably say two months, two months, something around that. I don't know. I'm going to do these really quick uh, throughout that Trotta Taylor donated $5 twice. Browns vs. Moore do donated $5 and uh, Miss K. Black donated $5 and uh, their comments are to Mars Boys, Fart Boys, uh, Happy Pride Month, LGBTQIAWKUK. That's, that's cool. Uh, Trevor, I don't actually think you look like shit. My girlfriend just has a big crush on you and it makes me jealous and I was taking it out on you also hi sam hi travis um cool uh i would also say it's okay if you think i look like shit that's fine um i, I I'm, I'm an aging man I'm, I, I'm i don't i don't look uh my best anymore um and also don't worry even if uh, even if your, your girlfriend uh, you know has a thing for me she's not my type <laughs> not my ooh, type ooh, I, I, I feel worse about that the Hoi Polloi donated eleven dollars. Said one OTP, OTP HJ, please. Principal Rolls donated twenty dollars. Said love you guys, Miss K Black. Oh, I read that one. Screw up donated ten dollars. Said to Mars, you take on it's always sunny. Bo Burnham's your take on it's always sunny. Bo Burnham's inside. I used to watch it's always sunny. I haven't anymore. I don't you know I don't not like it. Uh, I just haven't watched it a lot. A lot um bo burnham i'm not super familiar with a lot of his material but i think i was kind of anti bo burnham and but like once i actually saw his stuff i was like oh oh i like this guy like he's always pleasantly surprised me like uh what was that gucci yeah. eighth, eighth grade that was a good movie talented dude i don't know i don't see i don't really watch i don't watch uh comedy um, I, I think Bo Burnham is incredibly talented from uh, what I've seen. Um, but I like the idea. I haven't watched the new special, but from what I've heard about it, it sounds very interesting. And I, and I really like the idea of it. Um, but, uh, but I don't, I don't, I don't love comedy. Like I don't like watching it. So I, I don't, I, I'm very ignorant in the comedy space because I really don't watch much of it at all. Have I, have I told you what my new comedy thing is? The new comedy that I, I watched that I was like, this is good. It's uh, Frank of Ireland. You seen that? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It's, it's uh, with uh, the the son of Knuckles McGinty from Paddington 2. Hmm. The, the actor. Um, I forget what that guy's. Brendan Gleeson. It's his son. Um, I don't know. It's a good show. It's on it's on Amazon. Uh, the this Marsathon day made my day. Thank you, my kings. That's from the Simple Lord. Ten dollars. Uh, May McDonough donated twenty. Said Trevor, as a lady, let me just say that Blair can hold her own. Ladies aren't soft. I'm sure she's very familiar with the phrase "fuck off." Uh, That's a good point. Good point. Yeah. No, like I, I would love to have Blair on. I'll, I'll, I'll see if she wants to do it because she's hilarious. Winker eighty nine said, "Shut up and take my money." Alien Princess donated ten dollars. Said, "Have you guys ever seen a UFO?" I have not. I've well, heard. I mean, I've seen. I used, I used to live at the at the foothill of a, a military base, a secret military base called Peter's Mountain, in Virginia, and. Um, so I'd see shit all the time. You'd see stuff, but like, I never thought it was an alien. I was just always like, oh, the government's doing some fucking, they got some shit that we're not supposed to know about yet. And it's flying around right now. Um, so like if I lived in the middle of a place where there wasn't a military base, 
you know, then I would be like, yeah, it's an alien, but I know where I live. It would be almost as if, uh, like if I got a COVID virus, but I knew that I lived 12 miles from a COVID factory, I would be like, well, this probably came from there. From the COVID I love that factory. for a callback. That's a pretty good callback. Uh, the, the first conversation to the conversation exactly at, at, at uh, two hours in, that's pretty good. Not Whoa. to pat myself on the back. <laughs> But that's that's ten thousand hours right there. Who, that who, you work. know, some people thought Trevor had a bad memory, but apparently he can remember things from two hours ago. So, only for callbacks. <laughs> uh, he's he's still got it. All right. Uh, don't call it a comeback. Because it's a callback. Uh. All right. <laughs> you ready? You ready for this? Yeah. You ready to, to get marbling? All right. Yeah, I don't know how to do it, though. So, here's here's what you... Do you, do you have a separate Twitch account? You you know, I, I, I have a, a separate Twitch account. I can use mine. Do you have it on your it's, phone? It's the one that I use to watch all, all my hot tub ladies. <laughs> all right. I'll let, I'll let you... You're, you're going to be... Uh, you're just going to be uh the whitest kids you're gonna be this account okay does that sound good great great yes all right wait let me just throw in i was on stream but everyone's hitting play what does that mean it's 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 a thing all right so here we go uh what do i have to do oh wait where where did we go we go i'm gonna hit i'm gonna hit play too like they are yeah yeah are you are you logged into the whitest kids yep all right well let's go to race we'll do let's just do we'll start it off with what race we'll do a community map um favorites ratings Uh, something with a speedy, lovely route. Let's do that. Thousand I people. I hit it, but I can't play. I'm hitting it again. Wait, wait. So are you are you in? Are you looking at the stream or? Yeah, I'm looking at the stream. All right. Now, how do I how do I, Shit, how do I make yeah. my marble move? You don't. It just goes. That's the fun thing about this. Everyone from chat, if you want to play, you just hit exclamation point play, and you get to be in this. This is exciting. There's hundreds of people now entering. Exclamation point play. You there don't. Must be a, there must you do be nothing. A, there must be a lag because it's not exciting where I am yet. <laughs> it, it's going to be exciting once we see the race start. Uh, okay. Because it's all about just just being involved. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna take some of this bullshit off the screen for but us. Yet, yet you can't do anything. You, ca I can't control my marble. There's a mode where you can, where like it's it's like you can boost and stuff like that. But I mean, I think it's it's just fun because it's like the the chat in the whole room. Everyone gets to play and act like they're doing right. something. How do I? If someone says they. Can you bet? Can you bet? I mean, you could. We could, like, uh, do we have any mods that can, like, make bets in the thing? Wait, here. I want to bet $1,000 that I'm going to lose. <laughs> Wait, I'm going to the R Marzathon. Shirts. I'm going to hit exclamation point play. All right, here we go. I'm going to hit start. All right, do it. Someone says this is super AIDS. Okay. I like those old comments that are, that are like from a 12-year-old in the 90s. <laughs> All right, 10 seconds. This is AIDS. <laughs> Hey, 
and and they're off. Tommy Salami's in the lead. Wait, where, oh. Brutal butts. Oh, Camtron 1984 is in first. Camtron. Oh, and he gets overtaken. Lee Shoda is now in the lead. Let's see. Uh, looks like up. Oh. The great corner escape is 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 taking that that lead position, but oh Devin's brother, we know Devin's brother. Oh, but Devin's brother gets gets There's hit so up by many block. names. Look at all those. Names. Mimi's craft. Look at that. Look at Sam, that. Sam, where am I? How am I doing? Uh, let's see. Where are you? You should be a different color because you're. Sam, the, how am I doing? Where am I? I think you're the the. Let's see. Where is official WKK? Oh, it's right there. Right there. Did you're like good? kind of an orangey color. We'll see how you did. Uh -oh. Look there, I'm that green I'm right so far there. In the back. Guys, could everyone stop crowding me for a second? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so see the final results. Day Dagus Victor is your victor. Uh, and, and we can see if they right. typed anything during the cha the the thing. Play, play. Uh, all right, Dejus Victor, the Ricky Beamer, followed by You Can't Get Me 23. Can't get me, can't get me. Let's see, Nate Blackest got 38th. Let's see where I got 70th. Wow. Where is wow. official WKUK? Official WKUK. Ah, you got 207th place. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> I did terrible. All right, let's let's try another. Let's try another. No, that game that game sucks. I don't like that. I'm not good at it. No, you might be good the next time. When I was doing it on Wednesday, I did it on Wednesday night, and like, granted, there's only 60 people playing, but uh, uh, yeah, this is too many people. This is too many people. But let's do no, it in the no, daytime, it's exciting. That was too dark. It sucked. It's exciting. Uh, All right, one more. One more, like, and then I, let's I read Jonah's one more time. The, the whoever won is probably so excited that they won. You know, they're probably like, I bet, "Oh I wow!" Bet they're not. Victor, I are you excited? Bummed. Are you excited? Yeah, I came. I think he's bummed. I came, and I didn't even win. That's what someone said. All right, I'm about to hit it. I'm about to hit you the know start. what? I'm gonna say it. Every, somebody's saying like we love this shit, Trevor. But I'm gonna go ahead and say it right here that I bet this is bad for you. <laughs> like I bet this so, is not a good. This is not a. What good the sign. fuck do you care? This is not a good sign that this. Is what, we're... what the fuck? Are you, you fucking vaping? You're like this. I bet this is bad for you. Drinking your fucking white claws. Yeah, but I feel like this is bad. I feel like this is bad for your brain. You know. Oh you yeah, know, like, I feel yeah. like like like, that we're like getting... the white claw yeah. after white claw that you're drinking isn't bad for your brain. Now, dude, my brain is a fucking steel trap. Yeah, it's my body that's being destroyed. <laughs> it's okay. Dude. I don't think with my fucking liver. <laughs> all right, let's see. Let's, let's see what happens. Look at all those names. And they're off. All right, it looks like S Super Zero Design caught an early lead in the funnel and is making it out. Oh, this uh, is over. Followed it's over by Fentry. Who knows? It's, it's, no, I know. Super Zero Design wins. How much you want to bet? It right. Uh, actually, I think Fentry's going to win. You don't want to. You don't want to put your money where your mouth is. Uh, I don't have Venmo. <laughs> oh, oh! Super Zero Design almost fell off the course. Yeah, Super Zero Design is gonna win. Look at this. Let's see. He's like, oh, well, oh, he's no! Like, well, he's out. He's, he's well, out. No, he's not. What are you talking he missed, about? He missed. He missed it. Oh, Super there's a delay. Oh yeah, he's still there's, doing there's great, totally a he's delay. Still doing great where I am. But you gotta, you gotta land like there's gonna be a lot of people. We're getting a lot of deaths here. 
Let's see. Oh, and Spaceman Eric is our winner. Look, oh, a lot of DNFs. A lot of DNFs. A lot of people dying. All right. <laughs> Wait, it's, it's uh, people got to finish. <clears throat> well, you don't like this? This isn't the most fun you ever had? It is not the most fun I've ever had. I will tell you that. It, uh, I oh, mean, let's, like. Let's see if Sam Brad gets in. Oh, I finished. Woo. I won two races last time I played. That was really fun. Yeah. Uh, and, and you just died. Official WKK died. What place did I get? All right, so the winner there was Spaceman Eric, followed by Somniferous, followed by Super Scott. Let's see if they said anything. Woo? Whoever won is literally AFK smoking a cigarette because this shit is boring. That said, the, the guy that came in second... <laughs> I don't think with my fucking liver. Hey, I took second. Go me. <laughs> it's Van Eric. GGWP. Let's see his face, Van Eric. Yeah, I mean, look, to each their own. But for my own, this thing fucking sucks. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to do one more. I want to do one more. No. No, I'm gonna bail. We got it. Let's read bail. donos. Uh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. Let's... Read donos while I'm doing this. I, I sent you the link if if you check the, oh. the the fucking Zoom chat. I sent you the link. God. All right, I'm gonna read donos during this boring thing. All right, I'm going <clears> to. <throat> By the way, we should say to the chat, thank you so much for uh, donating tonight. You have helped us get closer to Mars, which we're very excited about. And again, I know we've said this a bunch, but I, I couldn't. My, my God, you know how much revenue we've made today? Yeah, it's been wild. Uh, thank you for thousand the. Seven a thousand seventy four dollars. Really? You know, that that's fantastic. Yeah. A thousand seventy four dollars. Uh, thank you so much. I mean, that that gets us so much closer to Mars. And, uh, you know, we've said this a whole bunch of times, but I really mean it. Um, it has been nothing but heartwarming to, you know, just start doing this stuff again after the show's been off the air for so many years and to find so much of you still out there and to find a community that's still interested in, in, in what we're doing and to be funding this film this way. Uh, we can't thank you enough. Thank you again. Um, all right, I'm gonna read some donos here. How do I read donos? Did, did I sent you that link? Did you click the link in the I chat? I clicked it. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, is there not a column that says donations? I'm looking. I see the today's revenue. I don't see the. Uh... Oh, wow. <clears throat> uh, if you look at the left where like the menu is. All right. I guess I'll, I'll do it while everyone's doing this. Uh, Alert box. I see alert box, alert widgets, app store. I feel like I'm going to. Oh, okay, cool. All right. Uh, here, I'll read the donuts. Uh, let's see. <clears throat> okay. Uh, donuts. Where was the last one? Okay, uh, there's two more donos. Uh, $55 from You Can't Get Me 23. Let's go to Mars. Looking forward to watching Trevor Moore show in Mars tentatively. Love you guys. And also, shout out to 
Mama Out of Bullets, who just posted a new sketch to YouTube. Hmm. Uh, Succubus just, Sally yeah. donated $10, said, I'm so happy you guys getting this movie together. You're welcome, by the way. Be sure to check out me and Professor Marth Live. It's pronounced live as in living. Oh, live. Professor Marth Live on Trailer Boys this Sunday. That's right. Uh, thanks, Sam. Uh, no problem. It's the uh, a perk for the uh, um, the Patreon. Nice. And also, we should say, check out the Trevor Moore Show, uh, which comes out <clears throat> tomorrow at noon on Comedy Central uh, on their YouTube channel. It's Sam and my and Blair Saki's uh, talk show that we've done a whole new season of, uh, and we want to do a third, so we want people to watch it. Uh, and it, it's very, I'm very proud of it. It's a really good season. Um, so check it out tomorrow at midnight, and then also Sunday, no, not at midnight, uh, tomorrow at noon, and then Sunday at noon, they're going to put up a, a new episode on both days. So please check those out. Um, is this, we're just going to watch the, the end of this marble thing and then we should raid fantastic plastics. Okay. Sounds good. Spectacle wait, or wait, wait. spectral rider is our winner. Spectral rider followed by list P followed by the female prefix suffix 26. Uh, let's see what the spectral rider says. Thanks for the stream <clears throat> boys. Include marbles in the Mars movie. Uh, come on, baby, let's go. Nice, I'm on the leaderboard. Let's go. I think whoever wins the marble races becomes an honorary whitest kid. For this second, now you're done. You were For that one second, you were an honorary whitest kid. Uh, that's cool, though. That's, that's, that's huge. That's cool. You want uh, something. All right, let's go back to a uh, regular screen and let's... Uh, how do you stop sharing there? Oh, oh, okay. Uh, let's go back to regular screen. Let's say good night. This is gonna be good. I'm gonna raid fantastic plastics. Be nice in there again, everybody. Please, thank you. Check out the Trevor Moore show starting tomorrow at noon on Comedy Central, as uh, a YouTube channel. Sam and I, we have a show in there. Um, I will be taking next week off and probably the next two weeks off from. Uh, uh, from flagship uh, because next week my parents are in town. So I'm going to be taking them around and doing tourist stuff. And then the week after that, uh, I am going to this rap party, but then the flagship will be back. And uh, the first guest is, uh, I think it's going to be James Adomian. Ooh. I was talking with James this week and he wants to come on. It's going to be fun. Like uh, he's a fantastic guest. One of my, my oldest LA friends um so it's gonna be it's gonna be great uh so we'll uh we'll talk to you yeah. soon and keep an eye out because because uh i i think um i might try and if trevor's taking next week it off i might try and do something um i think i might try and get some of my rick and morty friends to the people who wrote on rick and morty to do something with me uh, on friday uh, on friday yeah okay so we'll all right guys think that'll be fun all right all right everybody thanks again thanks for donating we're gonna raid fantastic plastics um setting the raid up now we love all of you we thank you so much for helping us do this film thank you nice command uh, i don't know how to raid anymore I, i'm officially that. a newsboy oh, no, no this wasn't newsboys this wasn't